Hello guys, Adam here. And since they're doing the uh, Southeast Asian Games today, Vietnam's playing Malaysia, I might take this opportunity to slide into Lotte Mart real quick and buy a new beard trimmer. I also use it to shave my head. And the sharp part popped out of it and actually cut the top of my head pretty bad today. So this is not a full tour of the Lotte Mart in D7. We're just gonna go up to the second floor and buy a beard trimmer. As you can see, my beard's starting to come out pretty good. And uh, get on out of here. So hopefully it shouldn't be too crowded. After that, we're gonna head down to uh, Nguyen Hue and check out the soccer match. All the people, it is a work day for me. You guys don't wanna look at my face. It is a work day for me, so we're not gonna stay there till the end of the game. I'm pretty tired. I've been up since 6 a.m. But I did want to show you guys the crowd and I kind of wanted to see it myself. So last time I was over there, they had all the big screen set up, but there was no game going on. So now I'll get to see it with the game actually going. But enough about that. Real quick. This is Lotte Mart. It's just a shopping mall in District 7. There's a big grocery store that way. That's where I used to go to buy all my groceries and I lived in this area. But as I said, we're just going up here to where I think maybe they still sell beer trimmers. It's where I bought the last ones, maybe a year and a half ago. So I know they're not on warranty. You know, they have things like Lazada, kind of like Amazon in the West. And I could order on there. There's no such thing as two day shipping. And oftentimes when you order things on Lazada, what'll happen is they'll, they'll let you order it, then they'll call you a day or two later and tell you it's out of stock and they, they have to give your money back. And you have to go order it again. It's not as convenient as Amazon in the West. So when you need stuff in Saigon or in Vietnam in general, I mean, I guess if you're in a homebody or you don't mind waiting, it's okay to use Lazada, but I hate it. I could barely wait for the two day shipping for Amazon Prime. So I'm not gonna wait on Lazada if I could take weeks. Even standing behind the guys pushing the carts has me a little impatient. I still have a little bit of that American attitude of get in and get out. I wanna get down in the windway and I'll show you guys that. By the time you guys are hearing me say all this, I will have already posted the soccer match video. So if you haven't seen that yet, go back and check it out. So it looks like the place where I used to buy or where I bought my last spear trimmers, I should say, still exists. This looks like it's still the same place. Let me find out. It has electronics and karaoke type stuff. But I do not see my beard trimmer. Oh look, right here. So silly delegated to this little corner. Wish you guys saw that on camera too, and I didn't even see it. Yeah, this is the one I want. This one's more only for your face. It's actually a pretty cheap price at 400K. I like it, let's get it. Problem solved. All right, I'm relieved. Get to get my beard trimmer. I mostly use it shaving my head, but my beard is getting bushy. Let's see what other stuff we have here while we're here. Some little radios, little speakers. Anchor, I know those guys make portable batteries. Gaming mice. It's all just cheap stuff. I mean, how good of headphones can you get for 500K? I mean, probably better than the headphones I have, but if you're gonna buy something nice. Probably cost a little more than $20. Anytime I bought something for less than $20 in Vietnam, it's always broken within a year. Like these beer trimmers will do. karaoke setups. I showed you guys that in my Nguyen Kim video. 
karaoke machine, so I don't focus on those now. Well, my girlfriend's distracted. I think I've showed you guys this stuff before, but every one of these shopping malls has one of these arcade centers. You guys remember Chuck E. Cheese from the 90s? Pretty much what it is, you go in there and you buy coins, you play the games, you earn tickets, and you turn them in for little plastic prizes. So, you guys remember Chuck E. Cheese? I think they have a new one now. I can't remember, I'm too old. If you guys remember what that is, leave that in the comments. I know there's something equivalent to Chuck E. Cheese. Man, I just can't remember. Some famous YouTuber threw a, a plunger. I tried to hit the sign on some video I watched a week ago. Jesus, what was that called? She's showing me? Okay, what's she showing me? This thing looks a lot sturdier. It looks better than the one I had and it's actually cheaper. She says, because it's discount right now. Ah, okay. She said it's better than the old one you buy before. Yeah, she right, remember right. the you buy the old one. Before. She remembered me buying it. No, she remember the old one. She uh, said she don't want, she don't sell it anymore. Yeah. Right now she just sell it because this it's is, better. This is my second time I broke one of those, those old ones. She say, I'll have my hand one again. Warranty three months. Three months. Yeah. It'll take me longer than three months to break it. First, she say after three months, that's the warranty for you. Okay. That's good because I bought the same brand twice. I broke it twice. This one actually looks pretty sturdy. So how much does this cost? So 399000 I'll put that up there in the corner. Okay, thank you. Come on. All right, guys, so that was my quick video of me wanting to go buy beard trimmers, which I also use to shave my head because I don't want to wait on lasagna. <laughs> I don't want to wait on lasagna. Who am I, Garfield? I don't want to wait on Lazada. If you guys enjoy this kind of content, hit that subscribe button for me. I'd really appreciate it. Give me a thumbs up or hit that thumbs down if you dislike this kind of content. Either way, leave a comment and tell me why. And, uh, I'm actually curious to how long it'll take me to put this video out because this is the night that the semifinals with Vietnam and Malaysia are playing and I'm going to Nguyen Hue to film the crowds there so check the date on this video and see how long it actually took me to put out this video because I think it's going to be a few weeks until I have some other videos that I'm prioritizing <laughs> before that but before I end the video for those of you that stick around at the end you guys should know that at the end of my videos I usually most of the time put a little something there at the end so I'll show you guys the parking garage and as you can see <laughs> maybe you can't see but I can see that this parking garage is dead everybody's watching football or what we call soccer in America <laughs> and I was actually able to get a pretty close spot so anywho guys, check the date on that. I bet you it's weeks after my Nguyen Hue soccer match video. Let's see how right I am for the second time. Thanks for sticking around to the end and watching my end credit. You guys are awesome and stay that way. So this is one of the Flyco beard trimmers and this is what they used to sell at the store. But the lady said that this is a better brand and they no longer sell the Flycos. So let's check this out, see how much better it is. Just worthy of note, my cat's already gotten into the box and knocked it on the floor and chewed on it. But it doesn't look like it's broken. Oh yeah, this has a really heavy metal feel to it too. Yep, it's got all your attachments. So I can trim my beard properly. Very happy and cheaper than price. You had this. This POS and this heavy duty barbershop grade trimmer. So I think I got a pretty good deal. What do you guys think?